Good morning. We are at Aldi. At Aldi's dumpster. Ooh, there's got to be something in there. Look how high it is. Okay. We've got strawberries and this croissant. Okay. We got to get in there. I'm taking these just in case someone comes. Idiot.
That makes it all worth it. See you at home. Hi, Dumpsterinos and Frugalistas. Welcome home. My home is your home. Come on by anytime. Shall we take a look at what Frugal Daddy brought back from his dumpster adventure? Let's. First, he brought back boo-boos. Mm -hmm. You banged up your knee. Yeah, this one has cleaned itself off on the inside of my shorts. Yeah, you still have dirt on your knee, though. You need to clean that for real. Mm -hmm. Are those varicose veins? No, it's dirt. No, no, it's not. Look at that. You're dripping with blood. You're going to get the botulism and the sepsis and the MRSA yeah. and the skank. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. There's gotta be something frugal about that. Getting all the diseases at one time? Dumpster skank. Dumpster skank. That's my new name. That's me. I was just so scared. It was <laughs> Wasn't so scared. really scary. This is why now people are gonna be all over you about safety and your lack oh. thereof. What are well, you doing with your shirt? I need a sp something was stuck on it. Your I belly? Need a spotter. I need someone with me. Oh god. Maybe a um like, if I had been really there, all I would have done was film you and laugh at you. Like, what could I have possibly done to I was help. stuck. I stepped on a, a box, a wet box, and flipped and went against the um, doors. You know, the big doors? And I just got stuck. That's fun. Yeah, and I thought, this is where I'm going to die. Makes it an adventure. <laughs> yeah. Well, you got to go somewhere. Why yeah. not in a dumpster? Yeah. Then Very I, convenient. I got up. Well, should we take a look at the food? Sure. Should we take a look at the bad strawberries first? All right, there we have blackberries and strawberries that really weren't good, but they're gonna get composted. So, eh. But here are the strawberries that were good, three packages, and I think they look fantastic, and blueberries. We have stuffed baby Bella mushrooms, artichoke spinach and cheese blend. That sounds delicious. <gasps> we should put them in the um, oven, air fryer. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And you yeah, can yeah, eat yeah, the yeah. Um, the outside, and I'll eat the inside. Oh, they... I get the mushroom and you get the stuffing. Is that yeah, what you're don't saying? Don't you like them? Don't you like the mouth feel or something? You say? Do they get crusty? No, no. Like, um... The mouth feel of mushrooms is very meaty, and it's used a lot in vegan meat substitutes. Oh. And I think if you're going meatless. Um, you know, if you put some mushrooms in your spaghetti sauce or cut them up in your salad, 
yes, it kind of gives you the mouthfeel of meat. Oh, oh. As does also, I think, eggplant. Yeah. Well, in just, in just oh. my little opinion. We as Pennsylvania Dutchers ate what we called hot pie. Pot which pie. was the Dutch noodles, the big wide uh, egg noodles. Yeah. With a can of cream of mushroom soup, soup. on it. Yeah. No water or anything, just, just that. Cream of mushroom. And noodles? And noodles, yeah. That was it? That's what that you called pot pie? Pot pie, yeah. They didn't put chicken in it or a bunch of vegetables? No. It's not pot it's, pie? Well, it was probably the mouthfeel of chicken. <laughs> that's what made me think of it. Yeah, I, I would have never thought of that. No. Except for, yeah, that was a good story. Um, well, good, I'll story, look Grandpa, good story, Grandpa. Good story. We've got black bean salad. This is pretty good. I like this stuff. Mm -hmm. I like it. We've got your Haribo Twin Snakes. So mm -hmm. appropriate in so many ways. Mm -hmm. Just because we know someone who loves the Haribo gummies and has snake tattoos. So, mm. quite apropos, I'd say so. Chia seeds. Ch -ch -ch Chia. Excellent. Green lentils. I'm very excited about that. I've been cooking lentils a lot lately. Mm. In fact, I have a little bit of leftover lentil vegetable soup in the fridge right now that I think I might go heat up. Delish. I was thinking of heating up your next item. Ah, yes. Croissant sandwich, sausage, egg and cheese. Or fromage, as we call it in French-speaking mm -hmm. Quebec. This was the first thing I found, and I decided this was coming with me, no matter what. No matter what. That's mm -hmm. the best. I hope you like it. Like cucumbers? Oh, look, Daddy. That is so keto-friendly. Keto-friendly bread. That's your thing. Mm -hmm. That's why you wanted chia seeds, for your keto-friendly bread that you're learning how to bake. Yes. Right? Yes. Les oranges, they look magnifique. Are these organic bananas? Well, yeah. Yes, they and are. An extra floater. Oh, a floater. Trying to cover oh, up yeah. that bruise spot? Yeah, I covered up the bruise spot. I actually wanted to make some uh, some of my little banana wedges. Oh, good. And uh, wow. so I need that super ripe one right there. Mm -hmm. I hope it's super ripe and mushy. Oh, it looks super ripe to me. All right, we have a can, one single can of soda. It's sort of like a... Like a, well, it's a, it's a lime seltzer water is kind of what it is. Not really seltzer, but soda water. We've got three bottles of Italian sparkling water. Brekkie. Let's have a little brekkie. Ready to eat oats. Blueberry. Well, that's a convenience type. It's September 30th. Um, I mean, no offense, yeah. but if you can't just make your own freaking oatmeal. Like, come on, dudes. Garlic. Oh, Oh, this is so good, yes, minced right. garlic, mm -hmm. because um, I've been thinking we haven't gotten fresh garlic in a long time. I do have some planted, but it wouldn't really be harvestable till like next, I don't know, June. Um, and the seal. And yeah, the seal and everything is great. And I've been using yeah. a lot of garlic powder lately, but I was thinking, I'm not saying this is fresh garlic. I know it's fresh in a enough. jar, but it's it's better than the powder, I'm thinking. Oh, yeah. You know, for my gourmet cookery. Yellow potatoes, organic, 1.5 pounds. A salad in the Santa Fe style. A salad in the Chicken Caesar style. And a second salad in the Chicken Caesar style. That's nice. I mean, that's this is a nice little haul. It's, it is. It's like we got lunch. lunch. Yeah, chicken thighs we can throw right on the grill. Yes. And then look at this. Look at this. Organic, grass-fed, freaking ground beef with a freaking date of 27 September. Ombra. And it's cold. It was, it was ice cold. So is this. This yeah, is cold. cold. Are the salads cold? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. Pretty did cool. You, did this you is a. The I did mention uh, the orange right before you, I mentioned you the banana. What escapee? This guy. He escaped, but oh. there's no hole. So it's oh. like he did a magic trick more, oh, more than that. Oh, that's cool. He like came on, through the uh, net. Arrested development. Yeah. Who was that guy? Job. Job, yeah. Army had a half day. <laughs> All right, good job, Frugal Daddy. This was a good one. If I pull back to show you and the food, they can also see what a mess the gazebo is behind you. Are you okay or with not. that? Or not. They've already seen it, though. Uh, and the lawnmower back there behind that. What are you looking at? Stop everything it. and the torn Stop it. I thing. I had to move everything for the party. Alrighty, so there you have it. That's our little haul. It's pretty cool. And what do we always say? It's better than a sharp stick in the eye. Yes, that is what we say. Hurry, Bo, twin snakes. Yeah? You posing uh, with so that? This is what made it all worth it. 
It's a gummy but then snake. This also did, and that did, and that did, and that, and that, and that. You know, the strawberries that are good are really quite oh, yeah, beautiful. Really it's nice. sad that so many were allowed to go beyond yeah. optimal goodness, but those are gorge. That's three cases of strawberries. Down to three. What a shame, what a shame. I'm hoping if I just chuck them all in the compost, some of them will sprout and become strawberry plants. That's my plan. We should just chuck them all over the yard. Yeah. Just chuck them and see what happens. All right, Dumpster Hands and Frugal Lisas, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed your time in the dumpster with Frugal Daddy. Sorry he scared you with his little fall there. I know you, I know you did. You're very brave. We'll see you again soon. Are you? Oh, did I you, may have. May, did you I really may have, cry? It, it was dark. I, I oh, cry. my Lord. We will see you again soon, I hope. I hope. After you've shared, liked, commented, and shared. What? Oh, what? subscribed. Thumbs, thumbs up. up is like. That's what confused yeah. me. Yeah, yeah. Like thumbs up. Like thumbs up. Like. Anyway, until then. Stay thriving, stay jiving, stay alive in, high five in. Where are you? I and dumpster never... diving. It did finally occur to me. I was just hold still and let yeah, you hit my hand. Yeah, I was gonna say you'll never make it as a weather reporter. Oh, I know. How do they do that? We have a cold front coming. No, it's over here. Yeah.